guys welcome to another fantastic video guys in today's video we are going to create a, a, a digital website where we can be able to sell any digital products and um, i'm going to show you exactly how to integrate stripe payment gateway to it and also possibly i'm going to show you exactly how to also use paypal payment gateway so this video promises to be a fantastic video so i will employ you to watch the video till the end because at the end of this video you are going to learn exactly how to create this digital download website using google sites and also i'm going to show you exactly how to use stripe to collect payments and also how to, you can also integrate paypal and other payment gateways for you to collect payments now i'm going to show you exactly how to after collecting payments how you can also deliver this digital product or whatever thing you are trying to sell to your, your customers i'm going to show you exactly how to deliver this thing so this video is packed with a lot of information make sure you watch till the end in order for you to get all the information you need so that said uh, I'm going to dive to the video but before I do that make sure you are subscribed to the channel and you have turned on bell notification icon so that you won't miss any video once I drop them on this channel so that's it let's go so the first thing you need to do is to go to sites.google.com so if you go to sites.google.com let me just try and see if I can open that on a new tab so if you go to sites.google.com you are going to be brought straight to something like this now I have a whole lot of websites right here on Google site so yours might be very very empty so i'm going to show you exactly how to set it up so you can go ahead to choose templates so google sites have thousands uh, has a lot of templates that you can start work to work with but in my case i'm not going to use any templates you can also start with the blank canvas so once you've clicked on that blank canvas you have this section uh, you have uh, you have to create something like this so how do you create something like this in order for you to have a beautiful website where you can easily sell digital downloads so in this case you're gonna be selling like a book or something uh, an ebook or something okay so uh, if you want to do that all you need to do so let me use this as an example so if I can go ahead to click on blank canvas and then right now we have this header section so right here like what we have here up stores is what I call this so we have this page title so I can easily call this up stores okay so once you've labeled this up stores I like to highlight this stuff and then I change the type the font to impact I like this import impact uh, font a lot so once you've done this next thing you want to do is you can select the header types and the likes of them but I don't want to waste your time so all you need to do is to add an header image so I'm gonna click select if you already have an image you want to upload then you can go ahead to use the uploaded image you have so I'm gonna click on select and I'm gonna try and select um, a background image or I can upload my so I like this one this one is looking good so I'm gonna try and see if we can use this or yes let's see if i can if you can use this so i'll click on it and click on insert as you can see it's going to insert it and try to adjust it for readability sake now if you have a logo you can go ahead to add your logo here i don't have any logo so i'm not doing this but if you have a logo make sure you upload it right here so once we have gotten this header section now the next thing we want to do is we want to go ahead to add this um section so in this case i wrote the best book ever so once you want to do that just double click on this section once you do double click it's going to bring this stuff out so just click on it and you have this section so and uh, like i said i wrote um the best book ever so i'm going to also do the same here so once i do that i'm going to center this text that i just wrote and then i will try to highlight it and uh try to change the font so I'm gonna leave it as um, this area or I can just change it to this um, one and then I'll come right here to this section here and this select color and click on it and pick any color so in this case I have side 3 but you can as well um, click size 2 and you can also click on image and select the colors you want or upload any kind of stuff you want to upload so I'm gonna leave this one like this um, it's, it's beautiful just like we have here so um, once we have this one now the next thing we need to do is to add section okay so pretty much simple if you look at this section here you're gonna see we have different layers we have this one single 
double single this one this one this one so depending on the amount of products you want to sell let's say you want to sell like four six eight ten twenty hundred one any amount you can go ahead to add as many so i can if you want to sell as many as possible you can go ahead to track this and bring it here it's going to show up you have um you have access to add this product you can easily duplicate this and it's going to be duplicated duplicated again simple so i'm going to delete it i uh, don't need as many so i just want to show you exactly how to set it one up then you can set as many as you want so um i can as well drag this one and you can drag any as anyone you feel anyone you want to work with okay and use them so it's simple it's a drag and drop process very very simple to use so um I'm going to drag this and uh, once we have it i'm going to try to um replace it so the text comes here the image comes here or we bring it back here image comes here text comes here so very very simple so that's how i was able to create um this one so after you've done this now you want to make sure you upload your image and then your title your text and um, you can also add button so um if you come down here and scroll down you're going to see button so you can go ahead to give your button a name here so you can say buy now like i did the other time and then you add the link i'm going to show you exactly how to get the link but right now i'm just going to do something like this and um i can i can see something like this let's just leave this and then click on insert it's going to bring it here i can bring it right here and it's going to be here so if i add as many text as possible here now and then i can add um, title um, and then the image so pretty much very simple i just did a rough sketch to show you exactly how to do it so i'm going to continue with this one so once you have all of these things all up and running so you can go ahead to edit this one as as you wish or um, make it even more beautiful i just showed you the basic things okay so once you have this one's now set up right now the beautiful website so you can also preview this website so let's quickly preview this before i go ahead to show you um how to link a payment gateway with stripe and paper and the other and the other ones okay so we have um so if you have this right now as you can see it's looking beautiful on the desktop you can also see how it's going to look like on the tablet very very simple and neat you can also see exactly how it's going to look like on the mobile phone so this is this is exactly how it's going to look like very easy and sweet and direct as you can see with the buy now link you can take them to wherever we want to take them but i'm going to show you exactly what to do so to make sure you keep watching okay so right now we have the site set up uh product image is uploaded product title product description project um link you can also attach the amount here so if i click on this um stuff we can add um the amount so i can say something like um hundred dollars by now something like that let me just um, see if i can get this dollar sign okay i got it so you can do something like this and it's going to update hundred dollar by now or something anyhow you want it so once you've done all of this now how can we get a payment gateway to work so we are uh, in this case i'm, I'm going to sh i want to tell you about stripe stripe is a payment gateway that it's very universal anybody can use stripe okay so if you have access to stripe fantastic if you don't know how to create a stripe account make sure you're subscribed to my channel because i'm going to show you exactly how i was able to create a stripe account even from a restricted country i'm going to show you exactly how to set it up and it works i'll be able to catch as you can see this payout this is my balance so i was able to, i've used this stripe account and it works if you don't know how to create paypal account make sure you're following me because i also draw videos on how to create paypal accounts on this channel and it works actually as you can see i'm even having a negative balance so i'm going to top this thing up very very soon and um, if you want to know exactly how to avoid this negative balance tell me in the comment section and i can make a video about it so so many things um anything you want you can tell me in the comment section and i'll plan to make a video about it so right now once we have all of these things now we have this stripe so how can we use stripe to pay collect payments so the first thing you need to do is to we have this thing called payment links okay so you can search for payment links on your stripe so once you come to payment links you can create a payment link so i'm not going to be creating one but to create it simple just click on add new then add the title add the amount and boom you have your link but i'm going to use one of these links already that i have here already so if i come here and uh, click on the link um it should give me a link to the product so this is the link to this product if i copy this link now it's going to be copied okay so simple so 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 simple so now that we have this payment link we can easily come over to this um section here right now and um click on edit and then add a payment link so in this case i added a paypal link way before but 
I can replace this to a test drive payment link now and then click on update. So whenever um, someone comes to this website, if I click on a publish, now it's going to be published. So whenever they co come to this side and click on um, this pay, it's going to take them to a payment. Um, let's let's see if I can do that. So if I go ahead to click on publish right now, let me try to publish um, what I've just done and let's see if um, we can have it um, tested. So because I like to test these things um immediately i do it so that i can show you guys that it works so i have published it right now if i click on pay now as you can see it's going to redirect us to stripe where we can actually make payments this is lovely okay so make sure you, you keep watching so as you can see now they can add their email their card and they can pay simple just like that okay so now just keep watching i have a lot of other things to share with you so right now we have i've shown you exactly how to do it stripe and it's simple you can actually create as many payment links as you want okay so you can go ahead to click new and create as many as you want and enter all the information you want to enter so that's how you do it now if you want to do this with paper what can you do it with paper you can also do it with paper by coming over to this section called um coming over to this section that say um, paid and get paid uh once you come over here uh we're looking for paypal um as you can see pay links and buttons so once you click on that it's actually going to take us to um this paper um links and buttons page where we can be able to create paper links and paper buttons okay so let, let's let's see exactly how to do it so you need to watch closely because i prefer to use um um pay pay power links and buttons and like i said stripe also is actually a fantastic one to use as well but of course um stripe is very simple to use and it's universal paper can easily get your account closed or blocked at any time so you need to be careful okay so um right now um once we are here on paypal links and buttons so the next thing we want to do right now is to click on do we want to create a paper link or qr code or want to create a button so i'm going to leave it as create a link so the next thing we can do is create a product or services product or services name you need to enter the product or services name right here so you can name it or anything so i can say test um products and services id is optional you can leave it then you enter the amount so you can enter the amount here so i can just call this one for 20 dollars let's customer buy more than once at the time you can allow them buy more than once at the time that means they click on add uh, by now it's going to add it and then allow them to even add more but um, that's not exactly what we are talking about today do not collect shipping address so if you don't want to ship anything is digital stuff you can select this and if it's um you need to collect the shipping stuff you can now add the shipping fee and the likes and tax and all those things label so once you've done all of this and you you're good to go then you can go ahead to go to the next one customize your thank you page so you can actually um use a thank you url or no return you don't want to stress the customers you don't need those thank you stuff okay so once you do that then you have this um section so this is exactly how it's going to look like uh, thank you and if you come over to this checkout this is how the checkout is going to look like so you can actually select them to use apple pay you can also allow them to use their debit or credit card okay it's very very simple very 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 simple so this is exactly how it's going to look like but for us to do it so we need to click on create new and then once you click on create new now we can be able to create um the paper link or button and so you can create a new one or you can use it so um right here um uh, let, let's see like i said we need to enter some of these details so single product or services so we just select that product services name we'll do this and uh, so price just leave it as 20 like i said before um once we're able to select this come over here okay this one is optional come to this section so you can test it once you click on pay now it's actually going to pull up and um try to make payments so they can pay you with paper and they can pay you with every other um details okay so once we have this we can click on this build it and it's going to go ahead to build the link and give it to us i don't want to build a link that i don't want to use but if you click on this build it right now 
it actually it's actually going to set it up and give you the link that you can use now you have to just copy that link and come over to this section here and paste the link like we did for stripe so if you come over here you click on edit and you paste the link that it gives you i don't want to build the link like i said i don't need it and you know paypal it's paypal you need to be careful you need to don't need to complicate things this account is already my business account and i don't want to really complicate it that's why i didn't click on build this because i don't actually need this ring right now i'm actually just showing you for you to understand exactly how it's going to be like so once you click on it trust me it's going to give you a link to use now if you click on it it doesn't give you a link tell me in the comment section and i will guide you on what to do so once you have pasted that link that's it so any when anybody comes to your website and click on the link they are going to be taken to paypal or stripe whichever one you use and they can make payments now after they have made payments you can attach under it that they can send you a screenshot to a, so your whatsapp number or your email address with their payment details and everything so you can be able to verify and after that you can send them your products now if you want to automate this thing if you want to automate it then you can use um flutter weave if you don't want to use stripe you can add with flutter weave you can actually upload your products what you can do is actually upload your products to um your google drive for example for instance you can go to drive to google.com something like this if you go to drive.google.com so with drive.google.com you are going to have a storage um drive google drive is actually allow you to store anything so you can actually upload your um your products so once let me just use this one and just use one of these things that i have here so let me just once you have uploaded it you can go ahead to copy the download link so you can copy or stuff so i'm going to click on share and click, click on copy link now i've copied the link to this product now once we have this link copied we can come over to um paypal when we are trying to create this um paypal um link and code you can go ahead to um use the you can go ahead to upload that um you can go ahead to now send your customers emails after they have paid payment so how that works is you are going to have um a payment um you're going to have after you've collected payment you're going to have an email um tool you're going to use tools like um send fox um, email marketing to so whenever they sign up for whenever they drop their emails or whenever they make payments and they contact you you are going to automatically send them an email using um one of those email marketing tools. now if you don't understand everything i just explained to you then make sure to tell me in the comment section i can go ahead to make another video where i just focus on how to automate the whole thing but this is exactly how you can actually get to use google sites immediately and collect payment to stripe or paypal and start selling your digital downloads immediately without wasting so many time okay so this video is very very helpful and like i said if you don't know how to set up a stripe account actually with the stripe account you can collect payments from anybody in the world so it's very very simple and very easy and very sweet to use stripe so if you don't know how to use stripe so make sure to tell me in the comment section and i'll go ahead to show you exactly how to create your stripe account and how to make sure you don't get banned and also paypal if you don't know how to set up your paypal account tell me the comment section and i can go ahead to set and show you exactly how to set up a good paypal account that actually works okay so all of these accounts um i can show you exactly how to set it up so it's very very simple so for you to do this you need a google sites like i showed you exactly how to set up um stripe and you also need paypal or you can use any of them and you can use other payment gateway like if you're in nigeria or in africa you can use paystack flutter weave to do all of these things and um if you don't if you can if you don't mind you can also use paypal and stripe and to check out and other payment gateways as far as they are able to give you links to use you can use them to um sell your digital products so 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 simple so i want to believe this was very helpful if you um find it helpful tell me in the comment section if it's difficult tell me in the comment section and i'll be there to assist you to my best of knowledge okay so thank you very much for watching i will see you on the next video